Hello, everybody. <clears throat> Been wanting to go ahead and try these string pulls. Um, a little bit more without getting cells. <laughs> That's not always the easiest thing to do either. Anyway, I coated my canvas with just plain black paint and, a, and water. Now what I'm going to do is turn off the air roll. Hold on a minute. I don't know how my on my first video of my string pulls that I didn't get cells, but I didn't have my consistency done right then either because I was just starting to learn how to mix my paints properly. So, and then right now I didn't have any more white left without any flow troll in it, so I'm actually using white with some flow troll in it. <laughs> so we'll see what happens. Anyway, I think you all know about exactly how I do it, and that is, um, I will show you very quickly so we can get started. Okay, and I use two types of chains, been happy with these two. This one's getting a little knotted up, but if this is the box. The rope chain. Okay. Got this from a claw machine. <laughs> and seems to be ha hanging in there really good. Then I just use your simple thin one for the small petite weeds and flowers. Little flowers. That's it. I have some water on the side here so that I can um, clean off my chain because I don't want my white to be coming out black. Once I put slide it on the canvas and I'm going to dip it back into my white, it's going to turn this black. So I'm going to wash them off and then wipe it down with a washcloth. Slide it through like this. You know? Just slide them through real tight several times so we'll see what happens I've got flow troll there's so this way I didn't have any more white and I want to use a black background and a white flowers this time because I like black and white it's just pretty color they I like that I'm more like black and white person so I just went down my fingers twice on it, okay? I'm actually going to go three times this time. Because I don't want it to get... And that's how I did it. I'll do the same with the small chain. Slide it through my fingers about three times, but lightly. Whoops. I'm going to do this one a little bit different, not um, horizontally, but diagonally. I think that's what you would call it, yeah. Let's hope she's in focus. There we go. <laughs> Camera problems lately. I have a $300 Canon camera in. It just still gives me problems. Anyway, I'm wiping down my string. I just did it two times. I'll do it three, but the third one very lightly. So do not want it thick. And I tilted off this paint a whole bunch.
Tilted, tilted, tilted. So it just wasn't dripping anymore. Whoops. Let's hope that's centered. Looks like it is. Alright, let's see what happens. Moment of truth if there's going to be cells. some time <laughs> time will tell clean off my string really good I'm putting it in my water so yeah again this is just paint and water Enough water to help it flow. Boy, a sure a lot of white paint comes off of that chain. And I put it in the water. So that tells you how much black I could get in there. Putting it back in my paint. And I do not see any cells. So that's wonderful. Three times just like I did that one. And I'll wipe my fingers in between. Now I'm going to do a little bit. Since I'm doing this one long way, I'll do it a little different. Should have put it a little bit closer because I wanted to put one on the end, but I think I can still do that. Right on. I do not see any cells. Yay. I like this on the black. It's pretty. And rinse it in my water a little bit helps a little cloudy here in Arizona today oh and I tried that flower inside a flower yesterday mm, I'm not too crazy about that because Kind of came up fake looking, you know, just not natural, petite and pretty. I like the petite and pretty. It just looked like that white inside the black was just a little too solid looking. Try to squeeze one in here. It's scary when you use black bottom. Well, it's scary both ways, really. Either white, because you're messing with. Two opposite colors here. Alright, that was working out pretty good that way. I'm cleaning it off before I put it in my water. I think those, that flower, inside the flower, the flower, would be pretty. Maybe if you put some 
different colors. Like I said, that flower was real thick too. I just must not have cleaned off my chain real well. Now I'm going back into my paint. love these flowers but don't do them that often so I figured I'd go ahead and do a few more had a lot of requests so hope that's the same size as the other one Maybe I'll do some chain or some string pulls too next week because I haven't done that for a while. Well, because I like the chain. It just seems to work so much nicer. Hope I'm even on this. Sorry about my squeaky chair. Clean it off in the water. Let me check my camera. <laughs> I'm having problems with them babies. Oh, you didn't get to see the one on the right. See? That's why I have to check my camera. Apologize for that. I notice there's a little white spot here, so I'm gonna clean that up before it dries in that area with my dry stick end. Just gonna shake the cup. Got a spot there too. So easy to drip. Is that why you always wipe your fingers in between? Let's see how I have this little bit of a black or white spot, so just take your dry. That dried fast so that's okay because you can just take a little bit of black and touch it up but once it dries you don't see it just <clears throat> all soaks into the canvas the same so Oh, how long have I had that sitting there? Oh, thank you. I was afraid that it would soak down from the more paint, soak down from the chain there. Okay, I'm done with that one. Now I'm just going to do the small ones. This is the one that always gives me the problems. Kind of kinks up. It's kinked up right now. I gotta run my finger down and straighten up the chain. That's stiff today. Maybe I didn't have it cleaned off good enough. But I've noticed even if it kinks, they still come out looking good. 
Well, maybe not that one. Keep saying I'm gonna get another small rope, not this box chain like. But I keep forgetting. Every time I go to Walmart or something, I want to get one from there. Just a cheap cosmetic one. That's you can find them in there real cheap, maybe three dollars for a necklace chain. You don't need real gold or anything. Up. You notice you can just kind of put it down any way, and it still comes out looking cute. Look nicer than the other one. <clears throat> this one I am not rinsing off. Because it's so fine, it cleans the rag cleans it off really well. I better wipe it three times. Stay even because if I do different then oh. I'm gonna turn this chain around the next time. Well that one is weird. Hmm. Okay. You can fix that because you can put like another. You can take your tip, dip it in there, and you can put it like up in here and do it again. Just go, whoopsie, it's sticking to my fingers. Just to fill it in a little more. I don't need to be picky here. My black. It's becoming pretty popular. I'm just glad to see us not selling up. That one I did yesterday on my video, I wiped that off. I didn't like it. I feel like taking off that video. But just because mine didn't turn out right, somebody else can follow that, see, oh, a flower inside a flower, and then they can try it, and it'll come out probably better. Fix 
video camera turns off. And I'm learning, you know. I'm human. And the only way to get things going is to learn through my mistakes here. I have a lady that wants me to do one of these for her. Uh, but, uh, and she says she'd pay me for it and everything, but on a big canvas. So I have to find a big chain. <laughs> I think they have some at Home Depot and stuff. Lowell's. You can find that. I can find those too, but what I need is a long one. I can find them in Walmart and all that in the necklace section, but I need long. So, I'll work on it. I told her give me time. Well, I hope you guys are seeing this. Oh, yeah, you are. the white and black for the black backing. Gotta look pretty somewhere. This is a small little one right here. Of course my chain is not gonna work right. I'm gonna turn my chain around. See the other end if that's doing it. Oh. Oh. oh, that's all good. I could fix that again, hopefully. <laughs> Should have left him alone. Yeah, one little area can just make you think, ew. So, I'm going to try to blot up as much as I can. What I'm going to do is just black on this one area.
it's okay. If I mess with it anymore, I'll ruin it. So it's okay. Once it dries, it'll look natural. It's just not fluffy over there. I suppose I could try it again. We'll wait till the end here. It just doesn't want to curl when it comes to these little areas. See, it's just doing it again. So, I'm just going to accept that and make just a little stem. Okay. I could put a little more stem on there. spot too long while I'm videotaping here. I like this one. So let's see, I have to Don't you hate that when you keep saying you're going to do something and never do it? How many times I've said I'm going to not use this chain anymore and find a rope one? How pretty they would probably be. Okay, so that's it. So now I'm just going to go ahead and try to fix that. Probably gonna mess it up. It's good if you can get a little curl out of it, and it usually. <laughs> oh no. Okay. Pick it up as much as possible. Well, I'm kind of matching the other one now. There we go. And that's it. I'm going to call it quits. I know. Everybody says, you just keep doing the same ones. Well, you know what? I like them this way. But I am going to try to, you know, do some different ones. Where, uh, I do like other, a lot of other women, they do the little colors and lots of different colors on their flowers and stuff. But, you know, everybody has their own style. And I've been told these are plain. I have one lady say, well, why don't you do something different? And I'm like, you know what? I like this way. I like the petite, you know, just, I don't know how to explain it. Petite and uh, plain. Now with all this flower stuff, because these will match into a lot of places. So it's not bad. Turned out good. This is a keeper, that's for sure. And that I I think what would look pretty is if I make another one, an eight by ten on this side, and an eight by ten on this side. Or no 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 better than that. A five by sevens. Little tiny ones for the wall. That would just look pretty somewhere. 
Okay, thank you for watching. I know you guys enjoy these, and um, I just thought I would do another one because I've had about four or five people ask me to do another one. And I know I tried that flower inside a flower yesterday. It wasn't so successful, but it was a neat idea. Just didn't look natural like these do. I like these better. And I think this one's really pretty. I really, really do like this one. You know, this one's... Yesterday, I did not like it. It was like an eyesore. This is pretty. Getting the whole picture. I like that. I like the high, medium, low. It's pretty. Alright guys, thank you for watching. Have a really good day. Like if you liked it. And subscribe if you want to. Bye bye now.